Hi guys, good afternoon, happy Wednesday. Wednesday, my water is all the way over there. Hold on, If I'm gonna really get my water. If you don't have yours, grab it. How's everybody doing? I have absolutely no topic to talk about right now. Um, here is why I'm here. I did this once before and it was extremely helpful for me. First of all, I want to let you guys know I'm kicking major butt on my program this week. It's just, I don't know for all of us what makes one week go better than another than another. But this week I'm, I'm extremely pleased with the way things are going. I am, on the other hand, and I'm not here for you guys to say below, oh, feel better, Nina, or any of that stuff. Don't, don't know. <laughs> Don't waste your precious typing time because trust me, I can't reply. And that's one thing I want to let you guys know that I am having a really hard time with my hands. And I can dictate, but when I dictate, it gets all screwed up. And then it's like, then I have to, I'm that girl that does worry about, oh, I need to let her know what I really mean. When I know you know what I really meant. Uh... I was trying to get some housework done today. I had a great breakfast. I've been craving refried beans. I am doing smart points regular, not freestyle, so I have to count my, my points. I had three eggs because there was only three left in the carton. I wasn't going to have two and leave one in there, and I always have two. And I had refried beans, and it was nine, nine smart points. And then uh, it just hit the spot. It was so good. Worth every point. I ate that hours ago. I'm still not hungry. But the reason I'm here, okay, the reason I'm here is because I'm super frustrated and um, I'm thinking maybe if I talk it out, I will give myself a little grace over the situation as opposed to sitting in the living room and trying to do stuff and then not being able to do it. My hand, okay, I know this is old news. Old news, Nina, we've heard you talk about it. It's like totally, where are you? It's totally ripped up right now, especially my thumb, okay? And... I have this thing where, get it together. Let's put on a little lipstick. Maybe that'll help. Okay. The way I look right now, I'm right-handed. I can't hold a brush. I can't even get my hair up right. I'm just frustrated right now, you guys. I'm not like super sick or anything. I'm just really frustrated right now. I have to talk it out. Uh, so... That's why I look like this, because I can't hold a brush. And I am of the mind thought that if I am home all day, which I am, that my home should be in a certain order of cleanliness and laundry done and dishes done and everything when my husband gets home, because he deserves that. I'm home. He's out working hard. It may be an old-fashioned train of thought, but it's my train of thought. It's it's it was never even something we we talked about. It's what I am comfortable with. I, to be honest with you, I can stay home and sprawl out in the middle of my bed and never get dressed. And he'll come home and he'll just he'll be he'll act exactly the same than if I get on a ladder and I do the windows and I do the floors. But I respect him and I think he deserves that much. I can't get anything done with my hand today and I'm so frustrated and I just wish like, I just wish like, I had somebody here to help me just for today. Just, and you know what? I've already done the floors. <laughs> I've already done the floors. I have maybe three dishes, but the problem is, is I can't get my hand wet because then it gets worse. And why am I being so hard on myself? He said when he left this morning, take it easy. He, he didn't tell me he laid out some money for me, which is his way of saying, go treat yourself to lunch, treat yourself to something nice. And he doesn't care. He's going to come home. He totally doesn't care. But I just feel so, I feel so helpless. I feel so helpless. I wish it was on my left hand because then at least I could brush my hair and look decent while I sit here and cry on camera. <laughs> I haven't had a good drizzle fest in a while, so. Um, how's everybody doing program? Again, um, I am, the one thing that I can do that doesn't involve my hand is walk. 
and I've been walking all week and I'm gonna go walk now after I finish this and decide whether to post it or not. If I do post it, it's gonna be because I want to have a regular conversation with you guys and have some levity brought to my heart because you guys are always, you guys make me laugh, you give me conversation. Um, but don't put anything like, you know, don't worry or try this or try that. I want to have like, like pretend I'm your buddy and I'm like, I want to talk. Tell me what's happening in your day. Tell me how your program's going. Tell me about you. I, I need some distraction and I don't want to talk about this and I don't want to talk about, uh, this. <laughs> Thankfully, my joints don't hurt right now. So I don't have the arthritic part of this lovely little disease, but, um, so I'm going to walk. I don't know if I'm going to post this or not. I probably will because it's a form of communication for me. It's a way to, it's a way to I don't know what I'm trying to say, you guys. I guess that when I have all Oliver's at his grandmother's this week, and I guess that I'm much busier with him, much more than I realized when he's not here. Um, and I just don't have anybody around. Close by. I have some great friends, but none of them are geographically accessible. <laughs> All right, I don't know. Maybe I'll post this. Maybe I won't. If I do, though, I want you guys to pop on and just say, hey, what's happening? Maybe I should come on and do a live. Maybe that would be better. I don't know what to do. I do know I need to go walk, though. I need to air out this hand. And um, maybe Chelsea can come help me. I'm going to give her a call. Maybe she can come over. She's back um, closer geographically now. So maybe I can go pick her up. Maybe she can help me. Drink the water. Sorry for wasting seven minutes of your time. <laughs>